Hi guys, so I wanted to bring you a video today on the top five things I wish I knew in my senior year of high school. Number one, I wish I knew how good community college was as an option. So originally out of high school, I was supposed to join the Air National Guard and I was supposed to go military, do all my training, and then I was going to get the GI Bill and go to Yukon for free. And that ended up not happening due to medical. And so I ended up at community college and honestly, it's probably one of the smartest decisions I have ever made for the sole fact that I saved so much money. I don't have any student loan debt and I graduate with my associates at the end of the summer. So to me, it was probably one of the best decisions I could have made. I may not have gotten the exact college experience that everybody talks about, but honestly, it wasn't that big of a deal for me. I feel like I'm a lot more mature than most people my age anyways, and I'm not a big drinker, I'm not a big partier, so it didn't really intrigue me either. So it would have been nice to live at a four year school and just go through four years and easy peasy, but it didn't happen that way. Life doesn't happen that way. So I'm really glad I chose the community college route. Number two would be that after high school, everybody goes on their own path. There is not one specific path that works for everybody. Some people go to a two year school, some people go to a four year school, some people take a gap year, some people go military, some people go into the job force. There's so many other options than just going to college. So I was in the mindset that I had to go to a four year school and do this and do that because that's what everyone else was doing. Now that I look at it, you're on your own path so you don't have to follow what everybody else is doing do what you want to do do what would do best for you in the future focus on yourself not what everybody else is doing number three would be that you're likely to lose a lot of friends that you have in high school for the sole fact that everybody goes their different ways everyone's gonna make more friends in college anyways so that your high school friends if you're not going to the same school and you're not rooming together a lot of times you're not gonna stay friends for a very long time unless you've known each other your entire lives and even then a lot of friendships fall out during college just because you're not you don't have as much contact and a lot of people just fall out of friendships and they grow and they move on Number four would be to enjoy every moment that you have. This is a great thing to do for life in general, but in high school, it seems like you're rushing to graduate, rushing to do this, rushing to do that, to go to your next step, to go into the military, to go to high school, to graduate, to go into the workforce, to go to another school, it doesn't matter. But enjoy the time you have with the people that you're with, because it's not gonna last forever. Enjoy having your family around you all the time. If you are moving out, going to a different school, enjoy not having to pay bills <laughs> for the most part because that's great um but enjoy every moment enjoy graduation enjoy prom enjoy every dance every sport every game everything that you have because you're gonna look back and be like i rushed through it for what nothing because you rush through high school then your next thing you're gonna rush through is college gonna look back and be like i wasted all those years of my life my youngest years my most like the time when I had the most energy the most time to do whatever to what keep brushing live every moment and number five overall life after high school is great because you have a lot more freedom but they say this all the time with a lot more freedom comes a lot more responsibility you have bills to pay you now have to take out financially you have to make your own doctor's appointments you have to take care of if you adapt a dog you have to take care of your dog pay bills you have to hold yourself accountable to things. If you rack up credit card debt, you have to pay it off. There's a lot more freedom when you graduate, especially if you're 18. Don't abuse it, because if you abuse it, you're gonna regret it later. After high school, it's not all a walk in the park. It gets hard. There's a lot of hard moments where you're like, what's the point? Keep pushing. There's no turning back. You can't turn back the clock. You can't go back to high school at any point. So just keep moving but just be thankful for what you have, the time you have, and that you're still breathing and you're healthy. But overall, being an adult does suck most of the time, but there are a lot of times where it is pretty rewarding. So this is my advice from somebody that is graduating with their associates. Uh, this in the next coming months, actually. So I will be moving on to a four year school after that. Um, but I love the route that I took. I'm trying to embrace every moment that I can, but just enjoy it. That's all I have to say. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Bye guys.